a shocking report now concerning voter fraud, and it's getting quite a bit of attention because it found that Hillary Clinton may have received more than 800,000 votes from illegal immigrants. The study authored by political scientist Jesse Richmond of Old Dominion University. The report estimates that 6.4% of an estimated 20 million adult illegal immigrants voted in the election, Clinton collecting 81% of the vote. This study, of course, of course uh, bolstering uh, exactly the president of the United States who said he wanted a full investigation of electoral integrity in this country. William de Jesus Romero. It's Romero, your last name. The name? Yeah, name. William okay. de Jesus Romero. Okay. A Put an X. 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 Put an X in this box. I get the passport. We don't need the passport, sir. All we need to do is to have you verify that you are who you say you are. I no. We do not require an ID. We just require that you state your name no. and address. I get passports? No, we don't need it. I go to okay, and how long do I have had to live in New Hampshire before I can vote today? Um, not long. <laughs> I don't, it's, uh, there's not really a set time. Uh -huh. How long do I have to stay in New Hampshire to vote today? Um, there's no requirement. Okay, and what do I need? Because I don't have an ID. Oh, okay. Um, you're just going to need to fill out um, an ID, um, just another form. I just have to fill out another form? Right. They will allow you to sign an affidavit um, saying that you live in Another now. state, okay. Or I don't, but I'm not living here as of right now. I'm just looking to Do vote you here. Have intention of living here indefinitely? Not indefinitely. <laughs> you want to vote today? You might tell them that you're with your friend and you're here indefinitely, which okay. is, sounds like it's true. Yeah. Okay. Um, gotcha. And if, mm, you yeah, it's not a hundred percent true, but I understand. Right, but yeah. You're here indefinitely, and you're you're you have your address at your friend's house. Okay. And then you'd be able to vote, and if otherwise... So I just, uh, fill this out? Yeah, fill both of these out, and I'll, I'll uh, Then I can vote? Right. Okay. Yeah, you have a, do you have a, do you have a mass license? I'm, I'm not sure if I have it on me, but... Yeah, I, need, I need a picture of it. Okay. If I don't have one, i got to fill one of these out and take a picture of it. Okay, that's, um, I, I'm not sure if I can fill me. I don't. Uh, so you need, so okay, I need to fill out this one. So I just need to fill out these forms and take a picture and I can vote? You got it. This whole notion of election, uh, or, or voting fraud, this this is something that has constantly been disproved. This, this, this is fake news. The notion that there are a whole bunch of people out there who are going out there and are not eligible to vote and want to vote.